Uh, hello, my name is Jose Vasquez. I'm Assistant Director at the Office of Environmental and Safety, which is one of the sponsors of the Science Cafe. And tonight we have Dr. Aubrey Jewett speaking about the redistricting process that took place in the last couple of years in the state of Florida. Welcome. All right, my name is Aubrey Jewett. I'm an Associate Professor of Political Science here at UCF and I am talking about evaluating the 2012 redistricting process in Florida. Uh, specifically, what I found was that uh, incumbents were not shown favoritism generally, particularly in the congressional and in the House seats, that minorities uh, were treated quite fairly, and we had record numbers of minority representation. Uh, however, when it comes to political party, uh, we still see some signs of party gerrymandering. Um, Democrats still have about a 4.5% lead in voter registration throughout the state, but Republicans still maintain a fairly significant lead in the congressional delegation and in the House and Senate up in Tallahassee. <laughs>